Hey guys, it's Crystal Renee here. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, thanks for joining. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Now let's get straight into the video. So this is what my Monsteria looked like when I first brought her home. She was full, had a lot of new growth, and looked like she was doing quite well fresh out of the store. This plant cost me around $7 or so. I think that's actually a great price for this size plant. During this time, I had begin to get curious about propagating so I decided to separate her and put her in two different pots which was a bad idea because she was left very stressed I had no idea if she was gonna survive this traumatic episode of me separating her Leaves begin to yellow, droop, fall, so I water propagate it. And this is what she looks like today. I am so happy my Monstera is back to great health. She's even better than before. Each plant is growing new leaves and doing great now that they're potted in soil. Everybody looks strong and green. I just love it. Funny thing is, all this time I thought this was a heart-shaped philodendron. And come to find out, I have four Monsteria plants, which was one of my wish list plants. So that is awesome now if i can only figure out where i will be putting them once they get large <laughs> time to clean the leaves first you get your water you will need a bowl or container like so you will also need some lemon or lime juice and you just pour the water into the bowl and you will add a few drops of the lemon or lime juice. You will also need a microfabric towel. You will dip that towel into your solution and squeeze it. You will gently wipe the front of the leaf until you remove all dust and dirt. You want to be gentle while doing this because you do not want to rip the leaf of your plant. You just want to remove all the dust particles. As you see me here, removing the dust and dirt also from the back of the leaf as well. And voila, look how shiny those leaves are. Again, you want to use gentle strokes. You don't want to be aggressive with the leaves. And to finish her up, you just want to gently wipe the stems of the plant. And you're done. Before I end this video, let me let you in on a little secret. Unfortunately, I didn't get this video edited and posted in time. So my Monsteria did grow a bit since the last footage you just saw. So, now stay tuned for the new and final update.
hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for